welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna install a stud conversion kit on my uh, B46 these are the um, lug nut that I got from a company called Ray Power it's a uh, pretty cool I think this uh, made in Germany is it say it right here um, Germany M and O Industrial Limited. So I hope it's a it's a good lug nut that I can use on the E46 M3. These are M12 by 1.5 millimeter. I think that's what M uh, BMW use on their wheel lug. And uh, this one is from uh, ECS Tuning. Okay, now I got the wheel off, and the next thing I'm going to do is take out my uh, spacer. Again, remember I have a 20 uh, millimeter spacer. That's why I uh, ordered this st stud that accommodates 20 millimeter spacer. So that's the maximum. So I'm going to remove this my spacer. 20 millimeter spacer right here. Okay, now once you remove that spacer out, I need to clean these uh, thread in here with the uh, brake cleaner. to clean this too. I'm going to clean all the stud on the short side. Make sure it's clean. So next step is uh, I'm going to apply a blue Loctite onto the short side over here on the thread. I don't want to use the red one because the red one is a permanent in case there's something wrong can't get it out so I would just use the blue one for my car. You guys can use red or blue. It's up to you, but uh, for me, I'm just using a blue um, Loctite. I think this is a medium strength. Yeah, right here, medium strength. You can see. I'm not sure you can see. They say medium strength right there. So I'm just gonna apply on the short side of the thread here, just a little bit. that and then just and tighten it screw it in with your hand and then you will poke this down to uh, around three foot pound I think with your five millimeter um, hex this to now I'm gonna 
I just until it click. Oh. Yeah, and hold with my hand onto the rotor and then just tighten it. Pretty sure I can't do that. Yeah. There you go, it clicked already. Should be easy. Wow, look at this stuff, it's protruding out. But here comes the, the fancy uh, lug nut that I bought. Let's try it on, guys. Oh. the blue medium strength I don't want to use the red but uh, you guys can use the red if you want to it's not hurt and then just screw it in by hand until it's snuck in leave it in there finish the rest of it Foot pound. 
quick and easy and the wheels stay there. All you got to do is just put the fancy lug nut in there and then you're good. This is my fancy lug nut. So cool, huh? Ray power. So I'll put a link on the bottom if you guys are interested. You can check it out and see. Okay, now these not not even have these uh, cap in there. Since my uh, studs is a little bit long, I have to remove this cap out. And this kit comes with these tools. These are you know, really cheesy, this plastic. A couple times these notch here will deteriorate it, but uh, I'm not going to use this cap. Anyway. Again, see, I still have a whole bunch of these uh, cap. So let me uh, try to put it on just so that you guys see. See, I cannot, I cannot screw it in. There's no threat to go in there because it's that push out so much so for the friend I can do it right. this is the complete stud conversion kit installed on my uh, E46 M3 alright guys thank you for watching if you like my video please uh, hit the like button and uh, if you're new to my channel, please uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, I will put more uh, video content on my uh, wonderful E46 M3 here. Thank you guys. Peace.